Hello guys, this is James here, and I'm going to be showing you how to make a automatic TNT cannon. So you're going to need some sort of building block. I like to use stone, um, some sort of slab, and I like to use this stone slab. Um, dispenser, redstone, redstone repeater, redstone torch, uh, a I got dispenser, um, lever, and a bucket of water. And then, of course, you'll need the TNT later. But, so what you do is you put, place one stone down. Oops. And then you place a bunch of stone for however long you want. And then you would place your water in. And then wherever it, the end goes to, that's how far you want this stone to go to. So you place it like that. Then you can take out your water and replace all this side except for the one block right here with dispensers. which should be facing this way in towards the TNT cannon. And then now you can put the water in and you're going to want to put stone in on this side like that. So that's the start of the TNT cannon. Then you're going to put a dispenser here which will launch the actual um, TNT that will shoot out over there and you put a stone behind it and a some redstone and then move this over here put a put nine repeaters one two three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, okay, so that's nine repeaters. Then you're going to set all of them onto the topmost, for, uh, I think it's three clicks, but they should look, they should look like that. One, two, three, yeah, three clicks except for this one at the beginning and then what you're going to do here is you're going to need to crouch like this and then you're going to need to put on all of your um, redstone and I'm doing this on my Xbox this is the Xbox version of uh, Minecraft and this is my Xbox One, so yeah, if you're wondering. So they'll meet up right here, and then that, if you put Team T in there, and you put the lever here, this could be workable, as you can hear the clicks. And this click should end up a lot later than the other ones, so... If you put this here and you do it, you'll see like I'll have to go through all those and then it'll click on. So it's gonna take a while to do that. But now that you got this, you will have to um, make a really big timer. So you're gonna need some open space. And you're going to want to put red uh, redstone repeaters. Um, you're gonna want uh, you're gonna want nine of them, just like in the other one. That is that's eight and nine. Then you're gonna set all of them just like the other one.
except instead the first one's going to be one click instead of zero. And then you're going to put a block there and a redstone torch. And this will go here. And so you can see if this is working for you. So it should work. So every once in a while, it will stop and send another signal. And it will stop and send another signal. So that's how fast it will shoot. It's kind of slow, but it will work. But then you put a lever right here, and when you pull down on this, it'll stop the it from keep to from going but another thing what you can do is you can put a redstone a uh, block and a redstone torch like this take off this lever put that like this and put another lever right here so it's not going to work but when you turn on the lever then it'll start going so that's another way you can do it. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take all, out all of that and you are going to fill your inventory with TNT. Yeah. That is if you're in creative. Otherwise if you're in survival then you just fill the dispensers. So you're going to put in TNT in every dispenser. I'm just doing one stack. If you want to make a really cool one, then you can do more. But for now, I'm just doing one stack, which should be plenty for the demonstration. Whoops. Okay. Hopefully that doesn't happen to you when you're doing it, but... Um, TNT in there. And TNT in there. So all of them should have TNT. Okay, so all of them should have TNT. And then... What you're going to do is you're just going to pull the lever. Now, I'm pretty sure another thing you can do is I think you can use hoppers and make them go into there. And then you can, what you can do is um, you can take, then take, um, uh, oh yeah, Chester Miscellaneous. Um, then you can take a chest and crouch and put that on and then you fill your chest with whatever you want and then it should, uh, the, well, not whatever you want, but you'd fill it with TNT and you fill your hopper with TNT and your dispenser with TNT and basically go on for, um, hours, maybe even days and you just keep going. And if you're like really into it, you can make like hoppers going to that chest, and you could just make a bunch of hoppers so that you almost have an unlimited supply of TNT going to it. But then, once you're done with all that, you just flip the switch. Oh, whoops. Forgot to say one more thing. So, one more thing that you have to make sure to do, I forgot to do it in this one, is to put probably a redstone repeater on like one of these areas, and then since you're doing it on there, you should do the same for this. It probably sounds a little weird, but it works. And... In fact, a lot of people use it if you do redstone. So, I 
as you can see, the TNT is launching over here. And some of it's actually going over there. So you just press press the lever. Not yeah, you just pull on the lever and it'll just keep going. And the reason I did this TNT cannon is you may like that it's a very like long range TNT cannon. So yeah. You Usually this TNT cannon will sit, hit in two kind of certain spots, and depending on the blast, I don't know what makes it different every time, but depending on the blast, it'll either shoot in a, uh, like a shorter distance, or it'll shoot farther away. Now, I've had this running for like a, a while once, and it's, it's okay, but then once it reaches, then sometimes it'll like reach bedrock, and it'll, I mean, it'll make a humongous cavern, but it's best for like if you're going up against like somebody's walls and like uh, if somebody's really annoying you so you go up to their walls and you just keep shooting a TNT cannon and um uh, it's kind of it would be kind of amusing I guess because I mean it's if you could if you could probably put stone like in front of this and it could or like dirt or something you can make it disguised as a mountain, and it could be like super duper stealthy. So, uh, that's pretty much all there is to it. So, I'll probably turn off the TNT cannon. Well, thanks for watching, guys. And if you like what you see, then put a like and subscribe.